took me to the candy shop. Good morning, guys. Cheers. <laughs> it is Wednesday morning. I'm feeling quite lethargic. It is even colder than yesterday. It's four degrees. I really want to go outside, but I know that's way too damn cold. <laughs> I don't need to put on my clothes just to go outside for five minutes. They're like 60 seconds, probably. I actually was going to end this video yesterday, but I have to. I realized, oh, you can just... Sometimes things will happen on days I'm not vlogging that I want to include in the vlogs. And I realized, oh, you can just say that and then cut to that footage. So I'm continuing the vlog today simply in order to show you guys the crazy bird um, things that were happening this weekend. So this weekend I woke up to birds going crazy and I'm going, I went outside for like an hour to watch them because it was right out my window. So I'm gonna cut to that footage right now so you guys can see because it's so, so cool. experiencing it like coming from somebody who quite possibly alrighty guys it's break time and I'm making my healing soup and so we've got some beef in here onions garlic salt pepper carrots I'm just gonna cook that up first then I'm gonna add in the tomatoes for a few seconds then I'll add my broth my bone broth super super good for you and then peas at some point. And then we're going to add some different seasonings, like just Italian seasonings, like oregano, thyme, basil, and stuff like that. I'm not just going to leave you. I was going to just leave you on that while I talked. But yeah, just going to add a couple of Italian seasonings, more salt and pepper, of course. And that's going to be our amazing beef soup to get me through the next few days. I'm so excited. It's already smelling really, really good. And it's so, so healthy. And that's what matters right now because we are healing our stomach. So I have a two hour break right now. I'm actually gonna eat um, some rice and eggs, I think, because this is not gonna be ready quickly enough for me because I'm hungry. So that's what I'm gonna have for lunch, and then I'll eat this later. Yay! Healthy life. The one off the corner, ambition and hot. The one that gives you systemic rusty vibes. Skyscraper high, how can it abide? Chocolate bars and gummy bears, all colors of well, if that wasn't an eventful walk, <laughs> I literally went on a, well, I guess it was like 20 minute walk um, around my neighborhood. <clears throat> I saw a dog wandering around, the guy was going crazy, and this dog's going crazy, comes right up to me, goes right up to a bunch of people. <laughs> Or, you know, a few people stepped out of their houses, the dog goes right up to them. I'm like, what's going on with this dog? The dog went to one house, I'm like, oh, it must be their dog. But I keep walking, the dog comes back to me. Then the dog goes and, and is kind of like following me. So I try to get up close to it and look at its collar. And it had a collar with a um, phone number on it. So I try to get a picture of it. Because there's no way I was going to be able to type that into my phone while this dog's going crazy. Um, this is a beautiful husky, by the way. I'm obsessed with huskies, so this was, like, really, really cool. 
Um, but I was worried about the damn dog. <laughs> so, um, I, it finally ended up going up to this person and it followed the person all the way back to their house. And I'm like, hey, is this your dog? Person doesn't hear me, I guess. Maybe they got earplugs in because they didn't answer me. And then, but the dog went all the way up to the house with him. So I'm like, okay, well, I guess that's their dog. But I tried to ask like two or three times, is this your dog? Have you seen this dog around? And I don't know. So they go up to the house and then a few seconds pass. So I'm like, okay, guess that's his dog. So I walk, keep walking around. I come back and I see the dog again, but he's met some other people, these two women. And so uh, those women are gonna call the number and, and take care of the dog. Um, what the heck? <laughs> what the heck? That was crazy. Um, I'm sure it's probably just a neighborhood dog, like they got out of the, a gate, but that was crazy. Um, next up, I, an eagle freaking flew this close to me. An eagle flew right past my head. I was just like, what? What? <laughs> it was so cool. Um, it was, wasn't going that fast, but I did not have time to get out my camera and capture it. But that was so cool. Like, the thing flew right next to my head. What? Okay, so that was a really eventful walk. Crazy. Also, my hands hurt because I didn't bring gloves. Because <laughs> normally I walk with my hands in my pockets. And that's what I was intending to do. But I ended up using my hands to pet the dog. And um, use my phone to try and get the number. Honestly, I kind of want to go back outside and like make sure the dog's not still there. But I don't know if I need to do that or not. I went back out and the dog was still out there. Guess those other people didn't call. Um, and there were, but there were other people there, again, trying to help this dog. So this dog would have been fine. But the, I called the number and the guy was right there. Actually, just a few houses down. So all is good with little puppy. <laughs> What a cute little guy. He had like one blue eye and one black eye. Um, I'm so it's pretty interesting. Well guys, we're very behind with the work schedule because of saving the dog. <laughs> no, I didn't save the dog, but because of the whole dog situation, then I called my parents to tell them this my story about the dog. And now I'm eating. So we're getting started like an hour and a half late. But that's okay. It's okay. I don't know if I ever updated you guys, but the soup is so good and my body is like shovel I'm shoveling it into my mouth because my body wants it. Um, I've gotten it that, this way with vegetables after starting to eat a lot more healthy in the last year. Over a year now, right? No, that's a lie. Anyways, after eating healthier, my body has started to respond to vegetables like in the way it used to respond to like chocolate or something. And yes, I still get that response for chocolate. But you know what I mean? Like this soup is amazing. And I can like feel it healing my cells one by one <laughs> as I eat it. So that is a good sign. And I'm going to have my dessert now. My rice cake and honey. Maybe two. Go crazy. <laughs> yeah. I have two hours of work left. And I really don't want to do it. Um, one of the main reasons I don't want to do it is my freaking neck and back are killing me. Like from sitting in just the most uncomfortable positions. The couch is really, really bothering me now. So I've been trying the bed and then sitting here, but there's no back when I sit here. So I'm just, I'm having a lot of neck pain as well, which is quite frustrating. But yeah, that's my update for now.
Not gonna lie guys, I completely forgot I was vlogging. I have 30 minutes or 20 minutes of work left and I just found some stuff <laughs> in the Airbnb. Okay, question for you. I found this, okay? It's in like this little kit, which this clip was also in it, and there's like some nail supplies in it. Like this. These don't look like they've ever been used. Like they look completely clean. But of course, I mean, you can't really tell when these have been used. Is it disgusting of me to use this? Because I like this, these a little bit better than the ones I have. So what do you think? <laughs> Please let me know guys because I'm looking for real opinions here because I'm not going to use this until I've gotten approval from you guys. <laughs> so let me know. Okay, so on that note, this is the end of today's video. I'm simply going to finish work and then um, do my puzzle and then read and go to bed. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye